Aries, keep it there, please. What is going on, baby? It's it's Mira. It's it's Shiva. It is Vera. It is Scorpion Red Tarot. I am back at it again, one time for the one time. Yes, indeed. To let you guys know what the energies is surrounding you for July 2020. Show me the monthly energy. I want to give a big shout out to every last one of you who has clicked, liked, shared, and subscribed to this video or any one of my videos, Father God. Yes, thank you for bringing your beautiful self on into the room, okay? Listen, if there's anyone who would like to book a personal and private reading, or if you want to send some love and positivity and a beautiful new deck because y'all done sent this one this one this one and this one okay over to the channel so thank you to everyone who has been supporting the channel um if you would like to support this the channel even more like i said or book a personal private reading just click the about uh tab on my youtube page it gives you all the information that you need to book a reading with me just send me a message on instagram if you don't have an instagram Email me at scorpionreds at gmail.com and I'll help you get set up on Google Hangouts, okay? Um, as you know, we always give love and light to the creator before I get into any message. We always give him acknowledgement and thanks. So let's go ahead and just, you know, give him uh, his moment. So, Father God, we thank you so much for um, being there for the sign of Aries, Father God. You know, we just been trying to take everything day by day and listen to what you say. We ain't trying to make no fuss and we sure ain't trying to cuss, Father God. Um, we just been just taking in every moment and just like patiently just taking every step Um that we can't, you know, um, doing the best with our 24 hours, Father God. I ain't gonna lie, it has been a little bit frustration dealing with this whole corona situation because, you know, it's been some bullshiggity going on. But, you know, like I said, we just been being humble and just gracious in every day. We thank you for blessing us with every single resource that we have, Father God. And we just going to keep our head up and continue to keep moving on and just keep it pushing. You know, that's about all you can do. Ain't no point in sitting there laying around crying. You know? Uh, so we just thank you so much, Father God. Give us guidance. Continue to keep us, you know, uh, level-headed and just focused no matter what's going on. Just continuing to press through is what is just been keeping us sane because we know we just want to make it to the other end of this tunnel father god so just give us guidance today thank you for just today and every day in jesus name we pray amen so let me see what the heck has been going on in aries life because <clears throat> that was a heavy prayer i don't know where that came from but i know it came from somewhere and uh i know Dealing with this corona and all of this foolishness that's been going on, everything being shut down, things trying to be opened back up. This is all this stuff been frustrating, especially when it comes to child care and just listen, look innocent. You know, it's like, especially when a lot of things have changed in your life and you was dead ass innocent, like you didn't do anything to just cause any of the changes that's happening in your life. It's just like, I don't understand what's going on. I'm just taking it day by day and just step by step. And I'm just praying along the way. And I know God will figure this out for me. And I'm not even about to sit here and trip because I ain't do nothing to cause this shit. You know what I'm saying? So I feel like God is sending you a lot of love your way because it's like, you know, look at my innocent baby. You know what I'm saying? Like, my poor baby don't know what the fuck is going on, you know, but I got you, boo. It's like the Lord is like holding you and just trying to soothe you right now because I really do feel like a lot of frustration and a lot of worry. And I really do feel like, um, yeah, like y'all been crying. Um, I want to say like even about relationship stuff, like things has just been a little bit tough and hard and. You know, like how they've been saying, like certain people have been impacted with their relationships. There's been a lot of breakups and shakeups and makeups um, during the Rona season and stuff like that. And I definitely feel like Aries is one of the signs that has been impacted by that. And it's like, you guys just feel like you're innocent. You know, bottom line, it says, beloved one, everyone is guiltless in truth. 
as no one can alter God's handiwork of perfection. Give us your feelings of heaviness so we can lighten your load. Give us any guilt, anger, or blame that may shroud your loving overlook. Enjoy the peace within your heart once more. Again, I'm trying to tell you. Now y'all saying it's just, it's just why me? You know what I'm saying? Like, why I gotta be going through this? Like, why I can't just have a love? You know what I'm saying? Why I gotta have the love relationship? It's just, God is just trying to make your heart right now. Because it's just heavy. And just a lot going on right now. And I'm honestly feeling like a headache right now. Like, right here and, like... In between my eyes is just like a pinching nerve. Um, the five of bows empowerment. Okay, now stand up for yourself. Shit, like I said, stand up for yourself. Empowerment. Like I know that you're tired of all of this fussing and fighting and all of this bullshit going on. Stand up for yourself. You know what I'm saying? Like. It's, it's time to fight. It's time to... Oh, Lord. Jesus, look at that penal. Jesus. And you know y'all Aries be gone. Oh, why y'all just do that to me? See, but look look at this. Look at this. Do you see how that y'all is just... <laughs> y'all. <laughs> Fucking Aries. Oh, right, y'all. Ooh. <laughs> Jesus, Lord, have mercy. Lord. Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> Let me move on. Y'all, I don't know if there's like a little penis envy going on or something like that. But I feel like, like, <laughs> like you got the big stick in the room, honey. And I just feel like a lot of people just be giving you the blues. Like this man looks tall. I feel like you guys are tall. You guys have stature. And not only stature, I feel like you have a reputation of just like, yes, like battling hard, like giving people a run for their money, especially in the bedroom. I ain't even going to lie because I know how every slay it down, bitch. Let me turn to you. Let me mind my business. Let me shut up. So listen. I feel like you guys have defeated many it's like you guys have defeated many and it's like you can do it once more. It's just like you just got to empower yourself to just keep going. It's like you're a very skilled master. It's like you know what you're doing and you know how to stand the test of time in regards to any situation. The page of stones, this is representing like a new plan. So with this being said, it's like if everything is being presented to you from the angle of people want to complain, it's drama, accusations and things, empower yourself and create a new plan. It's time for you to like start from the beginning with some grassroots and start digging and start seeking for something new to pounce on. Do you understand what I'm saying? It's like... <laughs> And you're about to empower yourself and just start going on your own mission. You're about to start lurking again. Like, that's basically what I'm getting. It's like you're about to start a new fucking plan. It's like I could take my big dick energy elsewhere. Like, I don't know <laughs> what the mirror in the reverse. Like, this is the hangman in the reverse. So, it's like whatever it was that you once wanted, you don't want it no more. I really do feel like that. You got new information or a new opportunity for a better chance where you can invest your money elsewhere where it'll bring long return. Do you understand? That's going to come without compromise. It's going to come without people feeling like they're trying to beat you down. You know what I'm saying? For anyone to have to say, like, listen, I'm the big man here. Like, I'm the one with the big dick energy. I'm the one. You know what I'm saying? Like, why the fuck am I being talked to like this? It just, what? What? You understand what I'm saying? Like, this person had to just, just, just stand up straight with a, with a, with a, 
you know, uh, arching his back a little bit. Like, hold on, hold on. Let me arch my back up a little bit and, and poke my chest out and show y'all motherfuckers who the fuck I am. You know what I'm saying? It's like, hold on, let me empower myself because these motherfuckers is in here tripping. Okay? And it's like with the Aries, it's like I'm not about to be doing too much talking. I'm about to be doing the walking, honey. I might have just get down from off of this shit. I, I see that this shit ain't going nowhere. You understand? Ain't no point of me being hung up on old fantasies, trying to work shit out. And every time I turn around, like, you keep singing me the motherfucking blues and shit like that. And I'm constantly feeling like I'm being pulled down all the way here. And I'm innocent. I feel like someone is being accused of something. Because still, like, the five of bows is, like, conflict, battling, competition. You understand what I'm saying? Like... Feeling like you in a situation where someone is constantly one up in you or something like someone might have did something to betray and try to hurt you because they thought that that's what you was out there doing. Like y'all in some type of battle competition, but I only did it because I thought you was doing it and you just like motherfucker like this is too much drama like the fuck. Okay, no, the four stones in the reverse. It's like. You've been too given to a situation that ended up like, end up, you end up giving too much to a situation that really ended up denying you access to true love and value. It's like you are only playing yourself by continuing to stay in a situation where you're being accused and beat down and feeling like you're in a constant battle or conflict and stuff like that instead of just empowering yourself and being determined to take better aim towards life you understand once you go from the that conflict of defeating this battle with the five of wands you go into the six of wands if you being literally acknowledged and being praised for your warrior skills for you know you being able to defeat for you being able to overcome like people want to be just like you and be encouraged and be you know victorious like this is you know so it's like realizing that when I look at the man in the mirror I don't necessarily like what I'm seeing and something happened I feel like the corona situation it put you in a situation where your back was up against the wall and you had to see things from God's vantage. The way God is seeing you do things and what you're putting up with and what you're allowing and what you're entertaining. Not only from their end, but from your end as well. It's like God lets you see everything through that mirror. Do you understand? And it's like, I don't want to continue giving to this because it's not doing nothing but depleting my value with just four stones in reverse it's like if i continue to entertain this you know god is sitting here nurturing me right now and trying to help me to stop feeling so bad about myself and to pick me up where i'm not crying and things like that but at the same time like i have to empower myself and walk away from this shit and start seeking elsewhere and looking for a better plan and a better opportunity for me because once I start looking and I start seeking and I at least start thinking materially on what I can do to bring some better investments and a better opportunity to me what I'm seeking for is going to find me you know what I'm saying and I will get the information that I'm looking for you know page pages represents communication <clears throat> so that means information about a new beginning, a new opportunity, a new advancement in life. So if I seek, if you seek, you seek, you shall find, you know. So I want to seek something where I feel like I'm better protected, that it gives me more inspiration to, you know, it's not lessening my value. It's actually adding to it. You know, God is not going to keep protecting me if I continue to give, 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 give to something where I'll never receive the eternal blessings that I'm looking for. And I'm tired of fighting. You know what I'm saying? And all of this is for what? It could be over some sex. You know what I'm saying? It could be over some sex. Like someone being accused. Look, freedom. Someone being accused of what they're doing with their magic stick. I honestly feel like that. It's like... Even having to put someone up against competition with someone else because you feel like you could find something better. You know what I'm saying? It's like, and 
It don't care they say my dick has a mind of its own. But it's like, yeah, it literally does. It's like, I just heard, I'm, this person is tired of being accused of things that they did with their penis. It's like, my, my dick has a mind of its own. He likes what he likes. And I'd rather just go and be with what he likes to be with. Like, why am I going to be with you? You understand what I'm saying? Like, I could just, I just, I just need to make a plan and I need to get off of this shit. Like, whatever it is that I'm so hung up on and why I'm staying here and what the fuck. I'm not happy. You understand what I'm saying? I need freedom. I don't even have anything more to give to this situation. I don't even feel like God is going to continue to keep protecting me here. Like, and I'm tired of crying to God about me not just being satisfied. Like, I... New information about a new chance, a new opportunity for you to actually be successful and happy is coming through the door. Freedom. Follow your heart and nurture your soul with love and freedom to grow. In order for you to truly be happy, you you know what? If it literally boils down to sex, it's like my penis has a mind of its own, you know? So he will put you in a predicament where you have to compete. You know what I'm saying? If he's not truly happy, go where he's truly happy. You know what I'm saying? Like, don't continue to create this stress and this drama in your life and things like that. You know what I'm saying? Because I feel like in certain ways you are innocent. In certain ways you're not innocent. You know? And if your dick gave you a bad reputation and you're being accused of some shit now that you really wasn't doing, but you did it before. <laughs> you know what I'm saying so it's just like just lessen yourself to confusion and just move on and just go where your dick wanna be at <laughs> it's like, does that make sense oh god and again like somewhere where you don't have to use protection somewhere where you don't want to use protection you know what I'm saying like you could really be let yourself go like you know it's like somewhere where you really like, you don't give a fuck if this person get pregnant. You know what I'm saying? You don't care if an innocent child comes to... Because it can't be with love. You understand? Like, you don't want to use protection. You want to give this person all that you have. You know what I'm saying? Like, you want to release your whole load up in that job. You know what I'm saying? You want to give this person all your ass. Up. You understand? Like, this person wants to have unprotected sex. And just want something fresh, free, and new. And it's completely old. Off of this old shit. Do you see how like this body is like being washed away somewhere else and it's being carried? So, like I'm done with that shit. I'm those are old emotions. I don't give a fuck. Freedom. Fred, for real. This person is definitely seeking. What is this? Pablo Picasso. Come on now. Mr. Picasso. Picasso. He said, listen, I got to. He over there looking at naked pants. <laughs> Why do I feel like this person likes to look at a lot of porn and shit? Oh my god. Yes. <laughs> it's like it's like sex is an art to this person. Just like looking at the naked body and just like, oh my god. I swear, it, like, oh my god, I'm just not. I just <laughs> my brain is just going a mile a minute. Help me, Father God, please. See, you know what? These these, these videos are not about to trigger me. But you know, like, so what? Look, it says, make seduction your greatest work of art. I try, I try, these motherfucking Aries, bitch. I cannot. I cannot. Listen, I'm tr Trouble, trouble. It's gonna be trouble, trouble. Like when the Aries come in, the, 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 the go to go to go where your dick wanna be at. Like stop causing trouble for yourself. Do you understand? Like if you finally released yourself from that shit and broke free, like just be at peace. Be at peace. You understand? Like do do not. Be causing drama for yourself, creating conflict and conflict and confusion by having people competing over your your magic stick. That's all I'm saying. You know, you have artist seduction, like you said, you the bull. You understand? You you you're very fiery. You're very feisty. You go after what you want and stuff like that. And to you, 
Listen, okay? <laughs> Love is an art form to y'all. Seduction is an art form to y'all. And y'all go after what y'all want. And you already know what it is. It says, being... Begin all affairs with good intentions. Remember, it's not age, it's experience. See, begin, oh, see y'all, trouble, y'all are fucking trouble. <laughs> trouble. <laughs> Even Picasso trouble, but, but <laughs> I'm sorry, I am tripping right now. It says begin all affairs with good intentions. Like, yeah, this started off with getting some art done and shit. But trust and believe, Picasso got his dick, so he got some pussy or something. Like, bitch, like, he's a little freaky little man. Like, I'm sorry. Like, y'all, what's with Picasso freaky little man? I feel like he was a freaky little man, y'all. I really do feel like he was a freaky little man. Remember, it's not age. It's experience. I'm trying to tell... <laughs> like, I'm trying to tell y'all. This fucking Aries, yo. This I'm trying to tell y'all. This man got some experience on that body and he know how to use that body. And I, I promise you, every inch of him is just, mm, 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 just like, oh my God, I just can't. I'm not going to be triggered. Why am I triggered? No, man. Y'all going to stop. Stop. And the area that I knew was not motherfucking innocent. His ass was bad to the motherfucker bone, but he was the sweetest motherfucker that I know. But he always claiming that he's innocent and he ain't do nothing. And yes, you did. Yeah. Yes, you did. But, and it's like, you know what? I'm not even about to go into his tea. Because I could definitely see his situation in, the, in these cars. Because it's like, my nigga, you not with who you want to be with. And you do be causing a whole bunch of conflict and drama going on. Because your dick want to be with who? Go be with who you want to be with. Do you understand what I'm saying? Like, whatever the fuck you holding on to. Like, the shit is not working for you. The four stones mean that you don't have anything anymore. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You want freedom. Go be with that work of art. That you want, you know? Bottom line. Motherfucking Aries always be trying to act like they don't be doing nothing. Y'all motherfuckers is trouble and you know it. Y'all need to cut it the fuck out, girl. Clarify this Picasso card. Look, right on Picasso. What is this? The Princess of Wands. So again, like this, this, this person is definitely looking for like a sexual conquest it's just like fat booty judy it's like this person is really looking for a beautiful beautiful sexuous beautiful vivacious it's about their body he's looking for body it's something about body and beautiful and brains bbb body beautiful and brains like that is what this Aries is looking for i really do feel like this person was with someone that they wasn't attracted to Picasso, now I could, I got the freedom. I could paint the perfect picture. I could be with who my dick wouldn't be with. And I'm looking for body, beauty, and brains. Bottom line. Bottom motherfucking line. And I got some magic stick to give to her. Straight up. All down her back. Okay? <laughs> okay, just like T.S. Medicine. Dick down your back. Okay? Dick down your back. He's trying to give you some dick down your motherfucking back, baby. And this girl... Listen to me. Whoever this is, Tony, to girl, I am scared for you. Bitch, if you, have you ever been with an Aries? Why you think I say Aries? Keep it there, please. Y'all, come on. Now, listen. Whoop, whoop. Jesus, it just fell on out on the table like that. Keep it stable. Hold on. You got the magician, honey, the fool child, the eight of swords, and then you got the king of pentacles. So what is going on? Oh, Lord, child. Now, this man is trying to manifest with the magician card right here. This is a, 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 a <laughs> he trying to manifest like a goddamn fool out here. He is just like literally just jumping. He or she is just literally jumping out there using all their tools, all their resources, asking God for a favor. He said, I'm trying to suck up like a lifesaver. Look, I'm rolling into her goddamn vicinity right now. God, listen, um, grant me this wish, please. Like, I, it's like <laughs> this person is really trying to manifest and call in. 
something that they really want. And, and, and again, as you can see, like the infinity sign, just something that's going to last always for all days. I feel like this Aries is kind of like done with the being accused of dumb shit and being accused of cheating and just sneaking around and, you know, doing little things. I feel like this person is done with that shit. Uh, it's, it's like this person wants to focus on what they want and only want only what's best for them and they're trying to roll into a new circumstance you know what i'm saying and just jumping out there on faith and they might have just jumped out there on faith off of that hangman in reverse and just got down and just completely just could have blindsided someone and walked away like a, a, a argument could have ensued and this aries could have just got you know, some information from this um, princess of wands. They could be dating like another fire sign. Someone that's a, probably a little younger than them, but just beautiful. Beautiful. And this is something that they think like, okay, no, my dick like her. No, he like her. No, he really like her. Like, it's just like, he's just like, instead of creeping away, nigga, I'm just going... Just be gone. Ain't no creeping. Ain't no creeping if I leave. You understand what I'm saying? Like, ain't creeping if I leave. You understand what I'm saying? Page of Stones. Like, mm -mm. I'm not about to miss this chance. Do you understand? Like, this is something fresh. This is something new. This is something that I've been praying and planning for. You know what I'm saying? Like, this is something that I'm very passionate about and I can enjoy and I can really, like, let myself off. And I told you, he feels like this woman is... A work of art he could be free with this person and like i told you he trying to let off all his stones up in his shit I, it's something about this person wants to have a lot of unprotected stuff it's like he wants to feel the four walls of that, <laughs> of that circumference do you understand what i'm saying but it's something that is worrying him sick because there is a responsibility to a child that needs constant care you know, I feel like there's a child that needs constant care. There, with the eight of wands, that I mean, with the eight of swords, that is um, being bound to being tied to something, like not being able to just walk away from something. Um, there's something that has to do with the responsibility to to a child and a child's mother that this person still has to be financially responsible for because that's the king of pentacles. The king of pentacles has to take care of his family. Bottom line bottom line but other than this child um i this 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 person is a manifesting ass goddamn <laughs> manifesting like hell like i am moving away i'm traveling like this person may be moving ain't maybe moving this person is moving freedom freedom and it's like they're taking this shit by force you know i'm just getting off of this shit period period so like my dick wants what he wants. Like, my dick wants what he wants. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm a boss. I like fine things. Listen, I like fine things. I don't want to be with... I don't want to be with you. Okay? I don't want to be with you. Don't know what you gonna do. I don't want to be with you. Look, I don't want to be with you. I'm tired of going a little crying and shit, bitch. I'm trying to let some nuts off. Okay, bitch? But... Anyway, Aries, why y'all so goddamn just nasty? Anyway, I gotta go, bitch. I gotta go. I love, I love y'all. Why y'all so nasty? Bye. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>